Does your Bible version lie about Jesus Christ? Here I have my good old faithful King James Bible I've preached out of for many years. And we'll go to the most famous verse that most people would know, at least they did in the past. John chapter 3, verse 16. For God so loved the world that he gave his only begotten Son, remember that phrase, that whosoever believeth in him should not perish but have everlasting life. Not very archaic. But what does the uh, NIV, how does the NIV translate this? If you can see there, NIV right there where my finger's pointing. How does the NIV say it? John chapter 3 verse 16. For God so loved the world that he gave his one and only Son, that whosoever, or that whoever believes in him shall not perish but have eternal life. You say, well, see, it says the same thing. Uh, not by a long shot. You see, there isn't just one and only Son of God. There are two sons. Let me show you. Luke chapter 3 and verse 38 says, it's given the genealogy and everything goes back to Adam, and it says, Adam, which was the Son of God. Check it out in your Bible. Your Bible will tell you that Adam is the Son of God. And if you go over to 1 Corinthians chapter 15, specifically verse 47, it will talk about these two different sons. The one is from the earth, the other one's from heaven. Hmm, the Lord from heaven. You see, the King James Bible gets it right, only begotten Son of God. The NIV and many other new versions change it to one and only Son of God, making the Word of God into a lie. You see, the Bible warns about, the King James Bible warns about that they would come in the end times and they would change the truth of God into a lie. That's what the NIV has done. They say, well, we're just updating the archaic language, not by a long shot. Uh, they changed the text and they actually created a lie. The King James Bible, the Word of God, teaches that there are two sons of God. One is created, Adam, and the other is begotten, the Lord Jesus Christ. He is born of God. Uh, Jesus did not have an earthly father. He had a heavenly father. Um, check out your Bible version and let me know in the comments what it says. Thank you for watching.